No, it is hard. It is so hard. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Hi, my name is Ruth and here's some angel energy just for you. If you are new here, hey girlies, if you are a returning subscriber, it's great to always have you guys back. I haven't posted on my channel for about two weeks, give or take, and it's because your girl got a job and I have been working. I've been working Mondays to Saturdays and I work long days. I work like I can leave the office, let's say about 8.30 p.m. And to be honest, it's quite a transition, but I'm super grateful because I'm living on an answered prayer and I have been enjoying my new job. I love my job. I love my colleagues. I love just everything about my job. It's been great. I've been super busy and it's been hard for me to juggle work and YouTube. So I thought I'd do for you guys a quick update video as I make some butternut squash soup. I've never made butternut squash soup before, but I've looked at some recipes online and it seems pretty easy. So as I catch you guys up and update you on my life on what I've been up to, we are gonna be making some yummy yummy soup. It's currently raining outside and I just want something warm. I'm sure my mom and my dad will enjoy it as well. So let's just get into the video okay so i'm getting my recipe from tiktok which i've gotten a super easy recipe what i need is i'm going to gather all my ingredients first and then we get it started the butternut in question here's our beauty we have also another butternut we bought this um this is from march i'm hoping this is okay does the butternut squash go bad i'm not quite sure this was bought in March, so we're gonna make this now. I need onions and garlic as well. Okay. We are out of garlic, so I'll probably have to go buy that just now. Really had no intentions of leaving the house, but we are going to go grab ourselves some garlic real quick. the garlic that took some time that took me about 20 minutes 25 minutes almost to get that stuff so what we're gonna use for this recipe like I said before we have our butternut an onion some garlic salt pepper for seasoning and what other spices would we need we can use some paprika too here's the black pepper and then some salt which is right over here, so I should probably start with preheating the oven for 20 minutes and then we can get this show on the road and we will start with um, chopping up the butternut I have seen online that guys are saying chopping up this butternut is like an extreme sport so I really hope it's going to be easy for me and not too much work so let me just clean this first Let's begin. Well, that's chit chat. Let's catch up for a minute, you guys. I have been working for the past two weeks now and it has been so good. I am so appreciative, like I said earlier. I am so appreciative of my job because it's really, really dope. It's really amazing. Okay, you guys, I really hope this isn't too hard. 
No, it is hard. It is so hard. Okay. Ooh, this looks nice. Wow. That is a great color. I'm seeing most guys chop it up like this. So delicious, it smells so good. Hooray! We got our button squash open. Do y'all see that? That looks so delectable. So once you open it up, the next should be pretty easy. I've seen you could bake it with the seeds or you could remove it. I think I'll just remove it because I can do that now. I hope you guys can see. Oh, removing the seeds is quite a process in itself as well. I'm probably going to just bake off the membrane with the seeds so that when, once it bakes, it's going to be easier for me to get them out. Yeah, like I was saying, work is great. I can't complain. For the most part, I have been detoxing my life. I have been detoxing from all things negative from my life and so far so good. I don't know how to say it but I used to be on the za but it's been 16 days with no za and y'all I feel great. I'm on day 16. As soon as the month of May began I said I'm not gonna do any za and I want to try making it to 21 days. I'm on 16 days without the za and life's just grand. I'm living life extremely sober and happy as happy 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 i can be and that's why i was like you know what let me just record this video for you guys and let's catch up and i hope also all of you guys are also great here are the seeds in question the membrane is quite sticky so i'm not gonna bother with that right now let me just chop up everything else and then i'll deal with the membrane later
that's the alarm um 30 minutes have been up let's check on our babies she is smelling nice let's get her out smells good it smells ready so this is what we have so far the garlic is here i'm going to wait for it to cool so let's just do that if it's not ready i'll just pop it back in the fork is going through this is fine i believe this is fine because after this we are popping it into the blender so i think we can work with this so let me just scoop out the membrane that was here at least now it's easier i really do want to struggle trying to scoop out the membrane earlier oh this smells so good i feel like i could just eat this like this right now but let's turn it into a soup so i pop them back in for another 10 minutes to make them softer and now i just want to put them straight in the blender
front of camera as we wrap up this video this took quite some time because i was washing dishes in between and preparing some rice for dinner so this is like a starter but let's just taste the soup and i'm excited for this wow mm. this is actually really really good this is actually really really good i don't think i've had butternut squash soup before even better yet made it on my own so this is so good so much better than i expected i didn't have any other type of bread we had burger buns so i'm going to enjoy my soup with some burger buns so dip 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 double dip but this is good mm. 10 out of 10 if you have made it this far into my video thank you guys so much for tuning in thank you for watching please don't forget to like share this video if you care and don't forget to subscribe i know i haven't posted on my youtube for about two weeks but like i say because of work and other things i'm trying to find a balance between work and youtube other than that thank you guys so much for being here with me and tuning in and i'll catch you guys in the next one angel energy is out bye guys